Hey guys. Hey guys. We are back together again. Reunited. <laughs> I don't know. He left me hanging. Yeah, sorry. And it feels so good. I've never heard of this song. Yes, you have. Um, so we're back together again. Yay. Um we are headed to go get some food. I'm starving and Trev needs a haircut, like for reals, needs a haircut really bad. I mean, we need to run a few errands while we're out. But yeah, it's a gloomy day today. It was raining this morning when I came home from work. Um, but it's not raining now, it's just really cloudy. But yeah, so going to get some food. Um, don't know where we're going yet. Um, I may try to decide. <laughs> so we were gonna go get some food, but uh, my buddy that let me borrow the the guns, he's getting off work early. So going over to my work, we're gonna uh, we're gonna drop off the guns or give him the guns. I guess I'm not really dropping them off, but giving him the guns, and then we'll end up getting some food. So we have decided to go get some Mexican food. Um, just a little tidbit, we love Mexican food. Um, we went by Trev's work and where Trev works, my mom works, so I got to see my mom for a minute. Shout out to my mom. Maybe we'll go to Target since it's right there. Maybe, I'm just saying it's a possibility. So, I am starving. I ate a frozen pizza at like 6 o'clock this morning. Did you really? <laughs> yeah. With Tabasco. The dogs didn't, they, they didn't uh, get, get mad. Wait, did you, you stayed up all night and ate a frozen pizza this morning? No. <laughs> okay, so, last night I, I started like taking apart my guns and whatnot because I want to put a new stock on it and after a couple hours of fiddling I noticed it was like two or three so I went and I got some food at, and then yeah if you don't work night shift just know it is really hard to transition back to like normal people time it is you get hungry at like the middle of the night that's when you are like the most hungry because that's usually when you're working and when you're working, I mean, one or two o'clock is like your lunch time. Yeah, it's, it's horrible for me because I worked the swing shift and all like I just worked four nights in a row. So my clock is like, okay, if you ever travel and you go somewhere that's, you know, three hours behind, you're still on your, your old time zone even though you're in the new one. Well, for me, I'm working 12 hour shifts, so I'm working night shifts and two, it, it takes two or three days to go from the night shifts to the day shifts. And like tomorrow I gotta get up at six, uh, 5.30 to go to work in the morning. So I, I don't know, it's gonna be rough. And I just work night shift all the time. So when I'm off and Trev's off, we're basically on my schedule. So he stays up late with me and then we just end up sleeping really late. It's it's hard. It, it's hard when you first start working night shift because you have to train your body to sleep during the day. I never had trouble with that because I was, I mean, I'd work so, like, I'd be so busy at night that when I got home, I would just be so exhausted that right when I hit that bed, I just passed out. And I still do the same thing now, but it makes it to where when I'm off, I feel like I stay up so late and then I sleep the days away. And I really try not to, but then when I try to get up before like noon, oh my God, I feel like a truck like ran me over. <laughs> Since I had to go to the, uh, the doctor, the doctor closes, I had to get up early and why can't the whole world just run on like 24 hours? Everybody has a night shift. That way you can go to the doctor. If you work night shift, then you can go to the doctor at like 
one or two like in the morning on your day on your nights off because that's when you're used to getting all your stuff done that's why when I clean I clean I don't get like the energy to clean till probably like one o'clock in the morning and that is when I like bust it out and I will like clean till four in the morning yeah yes last night I was I was sitting there and I was like you know what I want to ride the motorcycle I haven't ridden in a while I just want to ride the motorcycle I look down at my watch and it's like three o'clock in the morning <laughs> like okay my neighbors wouldn't be livid if I should, if I start revving my engine at three o'clock in the morning because I feel like riding my bike and I know if people walk by like our house and they look in all the lights are on at like two or three in the morning and like usually I'm like sitting there vacuuming like right by the window and they're probably like what is this girl on drugs or something like how does she have this much energy but it's just how it is yeah, I took the trash out at uh, 4 30 in the morning <laughs> yeah like night shift I mean it's hard because it's supposed to be hard just for your life outside of work I feel like working night shift really isn't that difficult working, and it's yeah working night shift is the easiest shift you don't have management and it's cooler for one for us because temperature is a big factor for us and for me my patients sleep so it's real good <laughs> but um yeah I mean it's really only difficult for your life outside of work I don't have I mean luckily Trev works kind of like the same kind of along the same lines like he knows what it's like to work with a difficult shift so he's understanding but my poor family they're like, well, can you come here like Saturday at noon or like, like I have a baby shower this weekend. It starts early. I'm just like, should I stay up? Like if something starts at 11, I get home at, <coughs> I get home at eight. Like, is it even worth going to sleep? I don't know. Yeah. So that's the only really difficult part. Early for night shift people is like anything before like 1.30 is early uh, for a night shift. You just have to think of it like. I mean, some people will say, well, don't you feel bad you like slept your whole day away? But then you also have to think like, okay, if this is you and you work during the day, right? That's like you going to bed at eight o'clock at night and waking up at 1 a.m. Like, I feel like people don't look at it like that. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Like they think, oh, well you worked all night. Oh, you slept till one day? Like you should be good. Well, that's like, like I said, you going to sleep at 8 at night and waking up at 1 a.m. and staying up till yeah. like the and the next working, night and at working nine. Another shift and yeah. yeah. So it's hard because, I mean, usually, usually when I work nights, I go to bed, I get home at 8, I go to sleep at like 8.30 and then if I have to work the next night, I'll probably sleep till 3.00. Or my bladder wakes me up at like 2.30 every freaking day. It never fails. Yeah, and then like when I would be off, like on the weekends if Trev was off or if he worked that night and was off like the next night, I would go in there and it'd be like 1 o'clock. I'd be like, okay, babe, let's get up. Let's go do something. Because like everybody else, I didn't understand. I'd be so annoyed. Like, why are you so tired? <laughs> she. she We'd be we'd be like over at her grandparents' house, and I'd sit there, and I'd, I'd be falling asleep on the couch, just sitting on the couch. I'd be falling. She's like, "Wake up, wake up!" I'm like, "Babe, I can't. I am tired." Yeah. And so it's really hard unless you don't understand. Cause I never thought of it. Like I was like, "Oh, you slept till one or two. You should be fine." And now Trev wakes me up before two o'clock. I like can't even. I'm like, no. <laughs> like I can't handle it. Has gas. <laughs> <laughs> <Nice>. <laughs> so we just got done eating. We're gonna go get Trev's hair cut. And we're gonna go to Tar Target. Target. Go to Target. Do, 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 we're do, just do. looking. That's what I say to him every time we go to Home Depot, and he always buys stuff. So we're gonna go to Target. And I'm gonna look around. Oh. What? She took it. Does that mean she's getting it?
I guess that's a yes. <laughs> Do we need to get another cart? <laughs> video if you liked it and want to subscribe and hit the bell for notifications of our next uploads